All right, Bill, I have your marmot finished. Um, I just did a marmot for you, but this is a 6S version. So it has pretty much all the same parts as the other one, except for the motors. These are the F60 Pro 3 1750 KV instead of the 2400 KV. This thing's gonna be a beast. Um, yeah, it is all all the exact same parts. You got the uh, Crossfire Nano back here. I got the heat shrink cut out where the bind button is, so it's easy to press. You got the Unify right here. I got a um, buzzer on top of here. This buzzer is crazy loud. It's almost as loud as the Hellgate buzzers. Uh, I think it's 90 dB, so it it'll pierce your ears. <laughs> pretty damn loud uh, I had this other buzzer on there and it just out of nowhere just started clicking instead of buzzing so I had to swap it out um, you got the big cap in the front there you got the uh, Radix flight controller and oh, I guess the foreign ones different too this one's the hobby wing 40 amp and that's it everything else is the same so, oh, I also added a special little touch. I had these, I've had these for a little while, um, but I haven't put them on anything yet. So I was kind of saving them, but I thought they'd look nice on here and they do look nice on here. Little uh, bottom protectors there. So, um, we'll show you the video and do a little hover. I haven't actually even hovered it yet. I did check the video though. It is already bound up to my radio. Let's see here. What's that one called? Marmot. Blue Marmot. Okay. Oh, another lucky thing too is the mesh. Uh, I only had one piece of mesh and it was like this long. And I was like, shit, that's not enough. But I went ahead and just cut it right in half and then cut those two in half. And it ended up just being perfect. So I think it looks really nice on there. All right, uh, let me get the battery on here. And here we go. Ah. Listen to that buzzer. Super loud. There's your video. Looking good. All right. Let's do a hover. Here we go. Please don't flip out and crash into me. Oh. All right. Whew. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Look at how smooth that is. It's so crazy. It just sits there. Even on 4S, those 1750 kV motors, man, you can still fly it on 4S. That's crazy. Oh, I almost forgot to uh, unlock the Unify, so I'll make sure I do that. I'll do that right after this video. And, uh, oh yeah, I did run the Smart Audio through Crossfire. I don't remember if I did it on the other one or not, but let's check that real quick. There we go, yeah. So that's working. I wonder if you don't unlock it, if it'll just go to 800 milliwatts or not. I think maybe it unlocks it if you do it through here, but I don't remember. Let me see if it changes. 
I'll just put my finger on the VTX. Uh, it is heating up. It is heating up. Oh yeah, that's getting real toasty. Okay, maybe I don't need to unlock it. It's it's definitely getting hotter, so. Yeah, it's getting real hot. So it's definitely going up to 800 milliwatts. Or maybe it's only going up to 200, I don't know. I'll just unlock it for you. Screw it. <laughs> All right, so there it is. Good to go, beautiful quad. I gotta get myself one of these one day when I hit the lotto. And uh, I'll get this boxed up and send you over, oh, I already sent you over tracking, so I'll just get it boxed up. All right, thanks, Bill.